Hey, what's up everyone? Surreal Canine here, back with more Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explore the Sky. In the last episode, Team Charm uh, went down the first half of the Boulder Quarry. Uh, we got our butts kicked by a pack of wild Larons, and uh, it turns out uh, Cindy here saved the day with her growl move. Let's uh, put away some of this stuff that I borrowed from Team Olympia. With interest. <laughs> Yeah, I'll bring down three, I guess. Yeah, this works. Maybe we should ask the Stanley Parable narrator. Alright, well, I am here to tell you guys that the left and right paths are practically identical, aside from the tile set, so, uh, we're gonna go up. No? We can't go up? Alright. I guess we'll go left. Both the left and right paths have only five floors. We have the uh, same uh, smattering of Pokemon of various different types. Lairons included, apparently. Ah -ha! Whoa! Surprise Lairon! <laughs> Go figure. There's a thing. And we have fallen for a thing. The world is now sadness. Yeah, money is always good. Berries, not quite so much, unless they're orange or citrus berries. Those are great! I would love having more orange and citrus berries, but they are not to be. Clunk. Oh, hey there, Ampharos. Yeah, you just do that thing. <sighs> it's a bird. <coughs> bird, bird, bird. There's always a bird to be in the way. Turns out uh, Sandy's pound, uh, due to having the same type of attack bonus, is a lot better than her jump kick, unless it's against somebody who's weak to fighting and resists normal. Laron seems to be the only Pokemon around here that that's true for, though. Sword. That would be nice if we weren't at the very end of the path. I did say it only has five floors. Hey there, guy. You exist. This is a pain. 
<laughs> Chestnuts. Imagine that being the thing that kills me. I would never live it down, ever. <laughs> there ain't nothing there. Sorry to say, ladies, but we gotta take both, <laughs> both paths. The right entrance must be the right entrance. It's amazing. Let's go. So yeah, more of the same. Ooh, another reviver seed. I'll gladly take one of those. Imagine if instead of Reviver Seeds, we had uh, Ho-Oh Feathers as our uh, <coughs> reviving items. Or better yet, Moltres. Well, I don't know. Ho-Oh and Moltres could both uh, have some pretty good reviving feathers. That would be way more cool than just a seed. Of course, I am uh, neither a Final Fantasy maker nor a Pokemon maker, so what do I know? Sticking to it. Oh, look, more iron thorns. Whoa, this is a lot of items. Surprised there isn't a monster house here. Hello, Burb. Goodbye, Burb. Speaking of Burb, I really gotta remember to, uh, to snag myself a uh, Songbird Symphony. No, it's not the best time uh, considering Pokemon Sword and Shield just came out, but. Uh, I did end up uh, naming my rook a burb. <laughs> Hard to believe there's a, a pure flying type now that is not Tornadus. It's a very strange thought to consider. I wonder who was responsible for that particular decision. Yeah, gonna have to blow my nose pretty soon here. How much I am yawning and being bored to tears and all that. It's coming out my nose. It's not the best. <laughs> there we go. Much better. I should, uh, probably heal Sandy here. Whoop! Video games! We got food! We also got nuts. Nuts! We got nuts! Well, nuts to you, Mr. Trap. We've been going the wrong way this entire time. It's a big surprise. I think I'm going to have a heart attack and die from that surprise. As they say, the thing that is also a thing. I will take an Orenberry. Thank you for your contribution to the ecosystem. An ecosystem of me kicking all you guys' butts. Hey there, me. 
Mr. the Guy. That's what you get for eating a pie. It was going to be my slice of stuff, but you had to eat it, so I've had enough. Stop spinning me all over the place! <laughs> Guys, stop going on the traps! This is the worst thing. <laughs> this is absurd. It's madness. It's crazy town. <coughs> it's not Sparta, though. You know, it is Sparta. Doing ten floors in ten minutes. solve a puzzle in order to move on. Hey Cindy, got any ideas? No, sorry, but I don't have the faintest idea. But right here there's two entrances, but other than that there's nothing. Cindy doesn't know, there's not much chance we figure it out. Uh, wait a sec, I don't want to be put on the same load as you, Mindy. Uh, what do you mean by that? Uh, just ask yourself, have you figured anything out, Cindy? Well, no. Actually, I don't have a clue either. That answers that. And that was pretty much what I expected to hear, so I'm not mad. We've been together for a while, haven't we? That's just like you, Mindy. Thank you. You're welcome. However, honestly, what should we do? Hey, wait! What? <laughs> Yay, I caught you! My perfect apple! You're... Ismelda? Oh, Steam Charm! Yay! Friendly friends! Why... Why is this Melda here? Oh, let me guess. You come in search of the treasure as well! Huh? Treasure? I don't know anything about that. Treasure, I mean. My perfect apple just up and ran away from me. I was chasing as it rolled away, and somehow I found myself here. Oh, I see. It's fine, it's fine. So, what are all you doing here? We can't seem to go any farther. <laughs> Ugh. You see the two entrances over there? It doesn't matter which entrance we enter. No matter what, we end up right back here. We guess there's a puzzle to solve, because we're all really puzzled. Can you think of something to try, Zmelda? Yay! Perfect apple, perfect apple. Uh, weren't you paying attention to our explanation? We got a plan, we'd love to hear it. If you could lend us your wisdom, we might be able to... <laughs> your wisdom. I think we're gonna have to look for help from somewhere else. You said it. It was a mistake to ask her. She's not listening to a word we say. No, nope, I'm listening carefully. Huh? You helped me, so it'd be terribly rude for me not to pay attention. And I think about it, it's a pretty cool problem, isn't it? There's only two entrances here. If you enter either one, swoosh, start again, start again. I give up too. I don't know. However... However... I guess... I wonder... If the paths you can see are the only ones. The visible paths aren't the only ones? Whoops! My perfect apple! Perfect apple! Perfect apple, perfect apple! Where'd it go? It smelled it just walked through the wall. What in the world? It, she disappeared. But if that's the case, you know it. If that's the case, in that wall, that might not be an invisible hidden... That might be an invisible hidden doorway. Blah. What? Could that be true? If that's true, Cindy, Mindy. Another twofer. <laughs> No, just one. Okay, yeah. Cindy, Sandy, let's find out for ourselves. Up we go. Alright, let's go. Alright, here we go. This is different. We've seen this area before. A limestone cavern. Past that wall, this huge limestone cave opens up. I knew it. I knew that wall held the secret to find the correct path onward. Uh, Zmelda isn't here. 
Yeah, she probably went on ahead. We should get going too. All right, ten floors and another boss. Let's do this. So yeah, this area we have seen in the uh, opening sequence. We got a bunch of water types here, among other things. Not that that matters, because uh, aside from Fire Punch, we don't have anything that would be impacted by uh, other guys being a water type. This is dumb. I can't switch with Cindy! Mr. Slowking. Slowking is the final form of a. Uh, actually, no, it's an alternate evolution of a uh, Slowpoke. <clears throat> you can evolve into either Slowpoke or Slowbro, depending on whether or not he's holding a King's Rock. There we go. Stuff got. Down we go. And a Krabby, are you just sidewalking? You're not a Krabby, you're a Kingler, the evolved form of Krabby. Yeah, yeah, he's sidewalking. That's definitely a sidewalk animation. Them crazy crabs. Another level up. We're getting some pretty decent levels on this uh, quest of journeys. No, oh, dang. Only these guys with a uh, avoid stepping on traps. By the way, I never uh, showed off everyone's IQ skills. Let's see here. Sandy has nothing interesting. Uh, Cindy has a couple of stuff. Nothing we haven't seen though. Mindy also has some stuff, along with the uh, Brick Tough, which is just a permanent HP boost. Which is nice, but there's other ways to boost our HP. <coughs> so many traps! Elise, uh, we've seen these hanging around the Fog Down Lake. They're bug flying types, I think. Nothing especially interesting other than their uh, blinkers and signal beams, which uh, blinker is an ability, I think it's called blinker, that lets them uh, summon a Pokemon every time they get attacked. It didn't seem to be working for that one, though. Maybe it's only Voldy that has them. Uh-oh, nasty plot. That's a super buff to uh, a two-stage buff to special attack. Hello, Kingler. Clunk. So many dudes! Oh yeah, I need to, uh... Well, yes, thank you. But, uh, I need to turn on everyone else's moves. Okay, Cindy leveled up. Mixing up my menu buttons again. We really don't need Mind Reader unless uh, somebody starts spamming Double Team on us. Sure. 
when you wish upon a star, you gain HP slightly faster. Okay, that was a pretty bad move there. Slightly faster than the average. It's amazing. Also, I don't know why I'm letting Cindy pick a fight with a bug type. It's a pretty bad move on my end. A tactical blunder, you might say. Am I really all full of items already? Yeah. Huh. Go figure. See, there's an instance where uh, having Mind Reader might actually be pretty useful. Yeah, there we go. Volbeat blinks when you attack it. Him. The. An. It, you know what I mean. It's just all kinds of stuff involved. Hey there, Meryl! Don't have to worry about you because you are not Tommy. I forget, which one was Timmy and which one was Tommy? I... I don't know. I think Tommy is the Meryl. They're my own names. You'd think I'd be able to keep track of them. I should just use a Luminous Orb. I really should. Wow, that would have been a huge dead end <laughs> if I went that way. I'm glad I uh, decided to use my orb. Gah! Jane, stop this crazy thing! Click. Blinkity blank. Blonkity blonk. More chestnuts! I'm sure a lot of traps in this dungeon, all things are considered. You deal with this one, Cindy! I will support you from the back! Boink. I did turn on her moves, right? Yeah, I turned on Wish. Did I turn on the others? Yeah. So, uh, Cindy's just being an idiot. There we go. She was not an idiot! Yay! You win a cookie. Oops. It's, uh, mixing up all my buttons again. You know what this reminds me of? The Secret of the Forest from the Chrono Trigger. Hello, Dragonair! The Evolved Form of Dratini, a pure dragon type. The very, one of the very first dragon types, in fact. Alright, we've hit a midpoint. Who knows for sure? Gah, yeah, sun in my face. What time is it? It's 3 o'clock, huh? I've been recording for a while. Alright, let's go. Actually, wait, let's talk to our, let's talk to our friends.
Wow, the opposite corner of the... Oh, hey there, Doug Trio. Hell. Wait, am I almost out of... No, okay. I was just misreading the world. You know, it happens sometimes. I don't know why they almost have a PP considering they just the uh, past the mid. But what a woman of a blorb! It could have been bad if it blew me onto the water. Okay, here we go. We've come pretty far. Not so long until we find the treasure. Don't be so impatient, Mindy. We'll get it sooner or later. Everyone, look! There's a light over there. Yay! W what is it? Let's go and find out. Mindy, Sandy, there's a treasure over there. Wow, that treasure chest is huge. Rumors of the treasure in the depths of Boulder Quarry seem to be true. You said it. Looks like treasure to me. Sandy, open it! Quick, I can't wait! <laughs> Patience is a virtue, Mindy. Opening a treasure chest should be done with grace and splendor. After all, aren't we Team Charm? I know, I know, but... Uh, the suspense is getting to me. Forget the graces, Sandy. Let's just hurry up. <laughs> Can you be a little more mindful? A little less rash? Alright, alright. I'll open it. Ta-da! The moment the treasure chest is open, what kind of treasure will be revealed to our eyes? What wealth of beautiful things will we find? That thought is filling me with excitement. Oh, truly, truly, please, don't disappoint me. I don't care about all that! Open it already! Here goes! Click. What? What kind of treasure is inside? It's empty! It's totally empty! I don't believe this! Maybe I'm simply exhausted? Maybe I'm simply imagining this? It is not your imagination. There is absolutely nothing inside that treasure chest, but why not? You! Team AWD? Ugh, the treasure! Did you already sneak off with it? <laughs> Looks like we are too late. No, hang on. We're not the ones who took the treasure. When we opened the treasure chest, it was totally empty. Don't lie, you cheater! It's not a lie, it's the truth. <laughs> You're gonna lie, could you at least be a tiny little bit more convincing? What? If you're gonna keep lying like that, then you're not a real exploration team. What'd you say? You had no chance to survive, make your time. I guess I'll just have to take it by force then. <laughs> you're all talk. Attacking us with false accusations? I knew the rumors were true. You're just villains. We can't forgive an exploration team like you. We made a promise to Centric, too. Looks like we'll be able to keep it. We're the Treasure Hunters, Team Charm. You, we're gonna punish you, so get ready. <laughs> I knew it would come to this from the moment we first met you. You never come up against a band of thieves like Team AWD. Prepare to feel our true terribleness. Make sure you savor it. Arbok, Drapion, let's go! Yeah! Mindy, Sandy, here they come! In time. Okay, let's go. Alright, let's see here. Confusion and Psychic will be really good against the two guys in back because they're both poison types. Fire Punch will be really good against Weavile because she's an ice type. Ice Dark. That said, let's do this thing. Looks like she's got pressure. Whoa, that's a lot of HP. I don't like this. Okay, that's one of them down. Let's get a Cindy in on the action. Yeah, that's what I like to see. Keep it up, guys. 
Gotta watch everyone's HP. Whoops, I missed. Oh, okay, not very effective. Why is that? <laughs> this is, yeah, these guys were way easier than the Larons. That was no trouble at all. <laughs> Blast. They're pretty strong. Yeah, you did pretty well, but don't underestimate us. Team AWD's true power. This isn't all of it. You guys, let's go! Yeah! Cindy, Mindy, here it comes. Be careful. Let's take care of it. Let's beat them at their own game. yoon -ta! What? Who are you? Ismelda? This is Ismelda? This guy? Recently, she's made quite a name for herself, despite how young she is. The Exploration Prodigy. That is Melda? This is her? Everyone, wait a moment. Both of you, please stop fighting. Why should we stop? They're bad guys, you know? That may be true, but fighting isn't good. Besides, you, you got caught in a trap to bring you to battle. What did you say? This fight was planned? Yep, this fight was set up. That's... Who did? The one who planned it is the boss who lives in this limestone cave. I don't know why he did it, but he wanted Team Charm and Team AWD to knock each other out. And by making you all focus on the battle, I think someone is going to great lengths to hide something. He probably just wanted to protect the treasure, I think. This treasure. Just protect it? Yep, but what I said so far, it's only a guess. That's why you won't know the truth unless you ask. Right, what I said. You were listening, weren't you? Ismelda? Is she talking to the treasure chest? Hey, was that the truth? Tell me. What? The treasure chest! It's shaking and rattling! It's a ditto! His name is Ditto. He's a Pokemon who can use move Transform. Transform? So you use Transform to turn into a treasure chest? Treasure chest? Yes. My food was stolen in Southern Jungle. That was you, wasn't it? Wasn't it? Yeah. That's right. I did that. I'm really sorry. And... Team Charm. I deceived you many times, Team Charm. I'm sorry. Huh? Deceived? See, as you saw, I have the power to use the move Transform. I was a treasure chest earlier, but that's not all. I can also transform into Pokemon. Is that true? Don't tell me. Back then... Oh yeah, come to think of it, the Bell Awesome and the Sentry did have ditto faces, didn't they? Yep. <laughs> that Bill Awesome and... I thought something looked a little off about that face, yeah. <laughs> I wasn't expecting a ditto face, so... You? That's right. Belossum and Sentry both. Honestly, they were me. I used Transform for deceiving you up to now. I'm really, truly sorry. Why'd you do that? Do that. Because, just as Ismelda said earlier, it was all to protect this place. Protect this place? This place? Yes. Here, I'll show you around. Please come this way. We've arrived. Huh? What? What's 
this? What's this slight? This is... There's something floating in the sky and shining. It's an incredibly mysterious scene. It's so... It's so pretty. Yes, very. It's making this blue-green radiance from its center. That light is illuminating the whole cave. This is very beautiful. It's just fascinating. I've never seen anything like it before, but... But this thing... What is it exactly? You don't know? It's a time gear. Huh? A time gear? Th this is... This is the first time I've seen it, too. This is... This is... Yes. This is a time gear. To protect this. That's why I'm here. Time gear, huh? I guess we don't have any choice. Arbok, Drapion, we're going home. Huh? Uh, wait up, you! Why? You're a band of thieves that does bad things, aren't you? So you're just gonna go home without stealing anything? <laughs> if there were some other treasure, it'd be fine. But you can't just steal a time gear and take it with you. You know we're scoundrels, we at least know that much. Is that so? Yeah, there's some things you just can't take. Like a time gear. By the way, we're not finished with you. Next time we see you, we're not gonna go easy on you. Arbok, Drapion, let's go! Next time we'll beat you up. Remember that! <laughs> it's a date! <sighs> so the treasure here was just the time here. Up until now, we've gotten every treasure we've aimed for. Yeah, this time we found something even we can't take. No way. It has to be this way. There's some things in this world you just can't take. Even though we can't take the treasure with us, I'd call us a success, wouldn't you? We even had more than a fair fight against the villainous Team AWD. Oh, that's right. Besides, that beautiful and precious time gear, we saw one for the first time, didn't we? Oh yeah, that's right. Yep, that's right! And we made it successfully through the mazes that stumped so many others before us. I knew it. We are the best, aren't we? <laughs> Um, that's great, everyone. Well, I'm headed home now. Uh, Cindy, Mindy. Yes? Got it. Huh? What's with everyone? It's Melda. You're not half bad. We got a better opinion of you now. Huh? You saw through Ditto's treasure chest disguise. You're really cool. Is that so? I see. <laughs> so, what do you do next, Ismelda? Huh? Next? Yes, next. I wonder. I don't really have any plans. Well, if you'd like, you can always come explore with us. With you? Yes, with us. What do you think? Hmm. What should I do? It would be fun exploring with you, but I've never explored with anyone other than my master. That Sandy, that thing. I'm on it. Hey, um, Ismelda? If you were to come exploring with us... We could give you this. Would you like that? Oh! It's a perfect apple! But... I haven't decided if I'm giving it to you yet. Let's get something straight. We're all pretty fast moving. Do you think you could keep up with us? What do you think? How about a race? Three, two, one, go! Yay! Go, go! I'll go everywhere. You ta <laughs> That sure was an episode. Ugh. That's all the recording I'm going to do today. <laughs> it was only three episodes, but uh, that was quite a bit of playtime. Oh so, yeah, it's kind of a totally unrelated... Uh, episode, but we know where the fifth time gear is now. <laughs> I guess Ben's gonna go get that one. Along with the other four we've already seen. It's just a thing that's going to happen.
but I don't have anything else to say. <laughs> Go home already. Pokemon Company! They sure are a bunch of dudes who do a thing. Chunsoft also does a thing. I kind of butchered one way heroics a little bit. <laughs> I don't know. That's just what I've heard. It's actually done. Are they a thing? Are we done? Are you a potato? Yes. 4K, huh? That's all well and good. So yeah, I'm gonna hack those guys into the party when I get the chance. It'll be fun! See you guys later.